New ad from Democrat Brendan Kelly attacks Congressman Mike Boss for his record during his time as a lawmaker. The ad says Boss works for himself, not his constituents, even voting himself a pay raise. News 3's Andrew Feather checks that claim in tonight's Truth Test. When I served in the Navy, I learned it's not just about service. It's about who you serve. A new ad in the race for Illinois' 12th Congressional District, where Democrat Brendan Kelly is looking to unseat incumbent Republican Mike Bost. In the ad, Kelly attacks Bost, saying he's a career politician who works for himself, not Southern Illinois. My opponent, Mike Bost, has been an Illinois politician for almost 35 years. He even voted to raise his own pay. That claim goes all the way back to 2007, when Bost was a member of the Illinois General Assembly. He did vote for a supplemental budget that included a raise for lawmakers, but that one vote doesn't tell the full story. The supplemental budget wasn't just a raise for lawmakers. It also included funding for schools and infrastructure improvements. In addition, Bost voted for a resolution the year before rejecting the proposed raise. In fact, Bost has a long history of voting against lawmaker raises during his time in Springfield and Washington. While in the Illinois General Assembly, Bost voted against pay increases for lawmakers more than a dozen times and even voted to require furlough days for legislators, actually reducing compensation. And since being elected to Congress, Bost has voted against pay increases 12 times, including a vote earlier this month. While in Washington, he has never voted for a pay increase. Did Bost vote for a pay raise in 2007? Yes, so the claim is true. But because it doesn't provide context and leaves out important parts of Boss' record, the claim is also misleading to voters. Andrew Feather, News 3.